Hey, what's going on guys? Tim here again. I'm doing another short video for you today. And, um, and I get a lot of questions about uh, what I use to finish my uh, paracord, you know, when I snip and singe. Now I have answered this in a previous video, but um, just want to do a slightly more, I guess, in-depth uh, talk about it. And if you look at my bracelets here, I'm just using this as a recent one that I did. Uh, whenever you snip and singe the paracord, um, you know, you cut the paracord off. I'll do a quick demo later. And then after um, whatever you're using, you might have a knife or scissors and you just kind of mash it down. Um, that's fine. And you can use that to make a nice smooth surface. But uh, for what I do, and a lot of you have noticed in my previous videos, um, I put a nice texture on it. And it I think it works really well because it matches kind of the texture of the paracord. And uh, if you look closely, the texture is this nice knurled texture. And how I achieve that is with this. If you're wondering what this is, um, it's actually an X-Acto knife uh, or X-Acto blade handle. Um, just to show you, this is what it came from. So you can get a lot of these. Um, I'll talk about where you can get them later. But uh, yeah, this comes as a set. You know, it comes with a few different blades. It's got, you know, these kind of straight handles. It's got this, um, you know, plastic red one for, I guess, better grip. Assortment of blades, right? But uh, what I use it for, obviously, is the knurled texture here. Because this, uh, this is knurled, so when you screw and unscrew and put the blades in to tighten it, um, that's what that texture is. Because a lot of people have wondered, you know, what that is. So, um, yeah, I just want to talk about that today and show you guys a quick demo. But uh, I like it because it just puts that nice little professional touch on your bracelet and it looks really nice. I feel like when you have a nice smoothed out uh, melted cord it looks a little it tends to stand out um, because the texture is quite different from the rest of the paracord just my opinion of course if you like to smooth it out and do it that way that's fine too so uh yeah let's just do a quick demo now okay so i just got some scrap paracord here uh just tied up this is the uh, cynical solomon if you're wondering i'm going to cut off the excess here you can use scissors or a knife i like to use a knife I'm going to cut that off. Okay, so now I'm going to take my lighter. I know I tend to never show this in videos, but you know what? Let's just do another quick demo. I'm going to take my lighter. I'm going to melt slightly. Take my tool, and then I just roll it across like that. There you go. Look at that. See, that looks really nice in my opinion. Okay, and then now our paracord is nice and secure. Let's just do the other side real quick. Okay, cut that off. Let's get our tool ready. That there. There you go. Oh, this one needs a little more melting. This is actually really hard to do behind the camera, but. There we go. Melted that one a little more, but this one looks really good. Anyways, um, so yeah, that's what this is. You know, it's the, um, let me get this stuff out of the way. It's just an X-Acto knife, or X-Acto blade knife handle. Let me refocus everything here. I'll just hold it up. But yeah, you can get these at um, in a lot of arts and crafts stores, a lot of hardware stores. Um, if you're looking for a set like this, you can probably find it, you know, in any sort of one of your local stores. Or if you're shopping, um, on online i'll post some links down below um through amazon usually and uh, yeah check out those affiliate links because anytime you guys buy stuff through my affiliate links you're supporting this channel and that's greatly appreciated all right so that's it for me today uh, i just wanted to do this quick little video in case you guys were curious and i hope you guys enjoyed this video all right thanks for watching guys i'll see you on the next one